everyone, it's Holly with We Love Cats and Kittens, and today we're going to look at a cat shelter called Kitty Tube. This outdoor cat shelter has some really cool features, however, there are a few potential cons to be aware of. Let's get into it. So basically, it's a giant plastic container that's insulated on the inside. It comes with a door flap, a pillow, it's built for all types of weather, and it has handles on the side that are designed to keep out moisture and protect the inside from rain. Last I checked, the price is $174.99. You also get the option for extra add-ons when ordering online, such as double insulation, which is an extra $45, an extra pet pillow, which is another $25, safe low volt round pet heating pad, which is $40. There are a lot of cool features to it, However, putting it together was not as easy as this nice man on the website makes it seem. The insulation was very difficult. It comes with it in and then you have to take it out so that you can attach the door to it and then put it back in and maneuver that around the door. Yeah, so the door was very difficult to get on there. Um, took me like 20 minutes. The handles were also very difficult to put on. He kept saying simply, while I'm over here struggling, simply snap the handles into place. Simply snap the door into place. There's nothing simple about the process at all. I put it together twice actually because I forgot to film it the first time. I should probably include footage of me struggling. So I took it all apart, put it all together again. Let's talk about some pros. Pretty lightweight, uh, it's well insulated. It seems pretty durable, withstand basically all types of weather. My spoiled inside cats liked it, even though it wasn't made for them. And the outside cats who it was made for were actually a little unsure about it. Um, they didn't know what to think because I guess they're used to toughing it out on the streets. We actually have little styrofoam shelters that we insulate with straw and they seem to like those, but I guess this was just too luxurious and they weren't used to it. Some cons, it was difficult to put together, at least for me. It is expensive. One thing I thought of is that it could attract other animals or wildlife. And the other problem with that is there's only one opening in the shelter that if another animal barged in while the cat was inside, the cat would be cornered and have no other exit to escape. Final thoughts. I think it has an overall good design. I think it's pretty enticing to cats in general. I think this would be really useful for animal shelters and rescues, cat fosters, anyone who has outdoor cats, strays that you feed. What I did with it, since our cats didn't really care for it. We ended up donating it to Heading Home Animal Rescue, which is our local animal rescue that my mom works very closely with and she actually fosters cats through the animal rescue, a nonprofit organization of community members who volunteer their time to help animals to rescue cats off the street and give them temporary homes until they can go up for adoption. So that's how that works. So that is what we did with it and it went to good use. Let us know in the comments if this was helpful. Again, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next review.